Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we'll be going through how we can fix display driver fail to start error on Windows. So the first solution is to run the Windows troubleshooter. So hit the Windows key and click on settings icon and then choose hardware and devices option under troubleshoot. Now go through the troubleshooting procedures and check to see if the issue still persists or not. So in case you don't have Windows 10, you can uh, hit Windows key along with that, open up the run dialog and then type in control.exe. Now look for view devices and printers option under hardware and sound. Now head over to the devices section and then right click on the PC icon and then choose troubleshoot. Now confirm any dialog options which may pop up and then follow the instructions which will appear on the screen. Now solution number two is to install the latest graphic card drivers. So hit Windows key along with that, open up the run dialog and then type in devmgmt.msc under the display adapter option. Right click on the graphic card option and then choose uninstall device. Once the graphic card is uninstalled, we have to download the graphic card as per the requirement of our PC. So head over to NVIDIA or AMD's uh, websites and then download the respective graphic card drivers of your PC. Once they are installed, check to see if the issue still persists or not. Now solution number three is to disable certain visual effects. Right click on this PC icon and then click on properties. Now go to advanced system settings and then click on settings and then navigate to visual effects tab. Now here choose the option that says adjust for best performance. Now click OK and check to see if the issue still persist or not. Now solution number four is to update Windows to the latest version. So hit Windows key and then go to settings icon. Now click on the update and security tab and then select check for updates. Now Windows will automatically download the latest updates and install it on your PC. Now once the updates are downloaded and installed, restart your PC and see if the issue still persists or not. We hope that this was helpful for you guys. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.